Welcome back. So I just watched the video that I wanted to share with you. It was a very interesting interview with Queen Latifah and it's a very old video, like nine years ago, I think. And they were interviewing her about a book that she wrote. I haven't read the book, but I've always liked her. She, she's a really cool woman, right? And in the interview, the woman was saying how, the, the, the person interviewing her was saying how in the book she mentioned something about that she doesn't feel beautiful and everything else when, when she's on the red carpet but that she does feel beautiful after a workout and then Queen Latifah was saying like yeah the, like that's when she feels good about herself after she's done a workout and I was thinking and the title of the video is learn to love yourself and I thought what a cool concept the idea of, of learning how to love yourself and figuring out what has an impact on you how you can love yourself in a way that gives you maybe the the benefits that you're looking for because i always say that i believe and i'm not talking about this video the, this idea that i just shared but i believe there's many what i would call maybe very superficial ways to love ourselves and i don't think those can go deep and truly provide the healing and the shifts that we're looking for but at the same time, I always say that we need all of them. Like we need maybe the super superficial ideas and the way deeper, more powerful ideas so that one of them, or maybe seven of them, will really resonate and will go way deeper than anything has ever gone before. So I like the idea and, and, and I've said things like this in the past of, of finding what helps you. Like for example, I love what she said about working out. When I work out, I do feel good about myself. I do feel good that I have a lot of struggles with my health. I have a lot of challenges with my health. So sometimes maybe if I don't have the energy, if I don't have the desire to do it, but I know it, it would help me. I know it will be beneficial and I do it. Of course, I feel great because of the endorphins and everything that's going on, all the changes within our bodies but also that sense of accomplishment that I did it. Like I put myself first, I did what I knew was gonna be helpful for me. I continue to move towards my goals of maybe being stronger, looking better, whatever it might be for you. And that entire combination of things feels good. And it might help you feel better about yourself. And that can be a powerful tool that can and maybe should be a beneficial part in our journey to be able to love ourselves more at a deeper level. So maybe take a few minutes and think about what are the things that make me feel good about myself? Like if you have a hobby that you love, but you never find the time to do it, but maybe when you do find the time, you feel incredible and you feel that sense of accomplishment and maybe that feeling proud about like, wow, like I was able to pull it off. I was able to make it a priority and that feels good. And that can be just a, another simple tool that will create that snowball effect and continue that momentum to be able to love ourselves more. I think it can be incredibly powerful. And especially if you use the, the example of working out, because we know that putting ourselves first, that putting our health first also, making our bodies and our health a priority, that will have incredible amount of benefits that will also help with the whole package. I just think it's a very, very cool idea and there's a lot more that I could talk about. I could keep going on for hours, but <laughs> I don't know. I have more videos, more tools, more ideas. If you want really, really powerful tools and ideas, there's a link below with some of the most powerful self-love tools and tips and hacks that I have. It's free. You can click the link below. If not, should check out the other, other videos. Make sure you subscribe. There's so much more coming. Make sure you turn your notifications on, whichever side that's in. And let me know if there's anything I can help you with. Watch the other videos that I'm gonna put up here. Um, a lot more coming, a lot more coming. I hope that helped. If it did, please let me know. Have an amazing day.